for Sunday the 3rd of February 2019 and welcome to another update for the Force 13's AU channel and unfortunately the severe weather system impacting North Queensland and other areas continues. Severe weather warning for damaging Likely destructive winds, heavy rainfall for people in the following areas the Northern Goldfields, the Upper Flinders, Herbert, Lower Burdekin, Northwest parts of the Peninsula Gulf Country, the North Tropical Coast, including the Tablelands, the Central Coast, the Whit Sundays, the Central Highland and Coalfields, and Central West of Forecast Districts. Damaging gusts and intense rainfall with significant flash flooding is expected between Innisfail to Bowen, including Townsville, and threat for heavy rainfall. Damaging winds remains elsewhere. A slow moving monsoon trough lies across North Queensland, extending from Ingham to Gregory Springs and into central parts of the Northern Territory. A deep semi-stationary tropical low is also embedded along the monsoon trough. This is Invest 96P and we're keeping an eye on the tropical low. And it's currently located around 130km east-southeast of the Century Mine. The monsoon flow is expected to further intensify over the remainder of the weekend, resulting in widespread heavy, locally intense rainfall with potential for damaging winds. The monsoon trough is expected to remain active into next week, with further heavy rainfall expected for already saturated catchments. The potential for significant and dangerous flash flooding will continue for areas between Ingham and Bowen. I should insert the word likely to continue. Now, the Bureau has two sections. In its vale to Bowen, including the Herbert, Lower Burlington and Townsville, for the remainder of the weekend, heavy rainfall, six hourly rainfall totals of between 150 to 200 millimetres are likely with concentrated areas of intense rainfall with totals up to 300 millimetres possible, particularly with bands of thunderstorms. Creek and River catchments already saturated will therefore respond very rapidly to any further rainfall. Uh, flash flooding it remains a high risk. Landslides have been reported associated with this event and will continue to be possible in those vulnerable areas that have already experienced significant rainfall. Damaging wind gusts of up to 100 kilometres an hour also possible about the coast and ranges and the Bureau has a severe thunderstorm warning in place. Locations under this uh, Warning, Innisfail, Tunney, Ingham, Palmine and Guru, Lucinda, Wallingston, Townsville, Guru, Air and Bowen. And 92 kilometres an hour wind gusts was recorded at Lucinda at 2100 hours last night. And rainfall since 9am yesterday, Ingham Pump Station, 506 millimetres. Halifax, 415. Garlock, 414. Cardwell Gap, 309. Remainder including Charter Towns, Georgetown, Concari, Mount Isa, Hewitt, and Koyama. Heavy rainfall may lead to localised flash flooding expected over parts of the Gulf Country, Northwest, Northern Gulf Fields. The Upper Flinders District to the, for the remainder of the weekend. Six hourly rainfall tunnels, 75 to 125 millimetres are possible, and likely high totals are possible with beds of thunderstorms about the Gulf Coast. 
Damaging wind gusts of up to 100 km an hour, also possible to the south of the monsoon trough and a tropical low. Monsoon or squalls with gusts to 90 km an hour may also develop north of Karayama during Sunday, particularly with uh, thunderstorms and locations which may be affected. Charter Towers, Georgetown, Croydon, Mount Isa, Konkawi, Julia Creek, Richmond, Hewenden and Kawayama. And Julius Dam, 187mm, Miranda Creek, 122 and Duke Gold River, 118mm. And those three were recorded since 9am yesterday. Bureau Meteorology here in uh, Queensland has a severe thunderstorm warning for destructive winds, heavy rainfall for people in parts of the Herbert, Lower Burdick and Forecast districts. Destructive wind gusts, possible heavy falls between the area south of Ingham and Rolling Stone. Intense thunderstorms have been observed on weather radar that may produce destructive wind gusts and heavy falls in the warning area. Severe thunderstorms likely to produce destructive winds, heavy rainfall that may lead to flash flooding in the warning area over the next several hours. And it's the area between Rollingston, including Rollingston and the Blue Water. Now we have a look at the total forecast of rain and the rainfall scale, right hand side of the screen. And welcoming rain for the western region. However, the Bureau has a Severe weather warning for abnormally high tides for the Peninsula and Gulf Country forecast districts. Tropical low over northwest Queensland expected to remain slow moving during the next few days. Strongly gale force west to northwesterly monsoonal wind flow will extend through the Gulf of Carpentaria to Australian waters as a result. And the Bureau has in place a gale warning for the northeast Gulf of Carpentaria, strong wind warning for the southeast Gulf, Torres Strait, the Plinch of the Coast, Cooktown, and Townsville Coast. And the Bureau has cancelled the one for the Mackay Coast. And on the screen is the area under the Bureau Severe Weather Warning. And water levels on the high tides could exceed the highest tide of the year on the Gulf of Carpentaria case between Burketown and Cape York, as well as on the Torres Strait Islands over the weekend. And locations which may be affected include Reaper or Torres Strait Islands, Aracoon, on Mapoon, Pompawar, Kawamba, Mornington Island and the case near Burgtown. You can follow Force 13's outlets, the website force13.com our YouTube page, youtube.com forward slash force13. On Facebook, under the same name, force13. And our Twitter handle, it's at force13 if you wish to get in touch. You can also add force13 on Skype and my personal account on Discord, fool13 at extension 9094.